My name is Jeremy Atlas. Yesterday, a complete stranger informed me that my father was dead. Are you Jeremy Atlas? Your father, Marcus Atlas, has passed away. It gets better. More importantly, his name is Sylvester Delbert, and he is a multimillionaire. Thank you. No, no, thank you. Now, my dead rich dad with another name also had another family, and they don't even know I exist. But that'll all change at the reading of his will. Jeremy, you'll be taking over the company. <laughs> that's it? That's our goodbye? That's all he had to say? Is this is so like dad! You can either accept or reject his offer of the company. I don't want it. This company belongs to me. What is it that you want? My daughter Missy is excited to meet her new family. It was all a lie. Our entire life is based on a lie. Nothing's true anymore. You're not going to take this without a fight. I'm true. Please tell me you did not sleep with that boy. Travis, for God's sake, she's your cousin. Kissing cousins have retarded babies. I can't help it. That's OK. There's a nice trailer park just up the road. Your son has totaled the car, scarred my daughter's head, taken her out of school, and was down at the beach drinking beer with her. Well, don't get your panties all wadded up. Speaking of retarded babies, meet Mark, my new brother. I have the best money lawyers can buy. Mark! You can't talk bad about the family. Gloria, my new big sister, sees herself as something of a role model. I've been married four times. This is Christina. She's engaged to my new little brother. She's an affectionate girl. As a parting joke, Dad assigned me his personal assistant, Denise Abbott. I'm trying to be nice. Keep trying, honey. Gloria, you know I don't kid. You can't fire me for a year after your starting date. Is this like a date? No, 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 that's... no it's... Don't! Get out of my bedroom! Get out! Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Who knew rich people had so much fun, huh? <laughs>